And back home, El Paso police continue asking for the community's help with the ongoing search for the man who violently attacked a couple at a home in central El Paso, leaving the woman dead and the man injured. It happened last year on November 14th at, the home, at a home on Copper Avenue that's right by Memorial Park. Investigators say the suspect was armed with a handgun and shot Georgette Kaufman multiple times, then turned around and shot Daniel Kaufman. Georgette later died and Daniel was injured, then taken to the hospital. The individual uh, that was involved in this murder is uh, believed to uh, possibly be a white male between 5 feet 10 inches in height to 6 feet in height. Now some of the descriptions that we have is that this individual could possibly be bold. Uh, also on the day of the murder, he was wearing dark clothing. One of the other descriptors that we have is that this individual has a thin build. And if you have any information about this case, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers of, El of El Paso. The number is right there on your screen. A GoFundMe 